Well, hello there. Welcome to the Odie Thorn Alliance. I'm Jacob. I'm Luke. And in today's video, we are reacting to June Part 2, the official trailer 2. If you like the sound of that, stick around, like and subscribe, and comment, comment down your thoughts. So, before we get into the trailer, what did you think of the first movie? I liked the spectacle of it, and I liked what happened, but I was utterly confused and why I should care about the main characters and why why it's set on the sand planet and what what was going on the writing didn't explain it at all and and expected you to have read the book that's exactly how I felt and I'm hoping the second movie delves into a bit more I don't like it when you got to see a movie and then you've got to spend twice as long researching mm. afterwards to try and understand it mm. and I don't know about you, it felt... I'm not going to say it's a copy of Star Wars because I believe it came out before and it inspired Star Wars, the books, but it felt the same. Like, I guess you could say Star Wars is a copy, but it just felt like a not-as-good version of Star Wars. Mm. You know, like I felt the main character was basically Luke Skywalker mm. in, in one way or another. Um, okay, well, let's get into it and then we'll discuss what we think of the next trailer. We're back on this song. You've been fighting the Harkonnens for decades. My family's been fighting them for centuries. And they were massacred. Alongside my father. My father didn't believe in revenge. You believe in Fremen. Let me fight beside you. It's looking good. I have no idea what's going on though. No, it definitely looks like a lot more warfare in this one. I will do it. <laughs> okay, so what do you think? For a neutral observer, someone that hasn't read the books, does it look epic from just a movie standpoint? Uh, yes. I think it. it's asking the question, is a prophecy... Should you take the prophecy? <laughs> it's very much like Star Wars, or take it to uh, your faith. Hmm. I can see what it's trying to do. It does look epic, but as you said, without the background knowledge, it doesn't have the same effect. Yeah. Well, you know, fans of the book, 
probably think this is amazing. They're finally seeing a visual representation of what they've seen. I know there's an old Dune movie, um, but they're seeing it on a much more high-end scale. But from a neutral observer, it's hard to feel epic for it. Like, I don't really care that he's a prophet. I, I honestly don't remember the first movie. It was kind of unmemorable. Like, I kind of found it was a bit of a snooze fest. Bottom line, are you excited to see it? As a movie, yes, but story-wise, I, I have no idea what's going on. Yeah, do you think you'll go see this one? Yes, I'll, I, yes. I'm in the same boat. I think I'll go see the movies only because I think it deserves that because of the, yeah. you know, the action we're going to see and the epicness. But I'm only seeing it, you know, more as a critic, not as a fan. So I, I'll go in there with an open mind, but I'm not expecting to walk out, you know, loving it. That's a yeah. fair point. Well, thank you for watching. Comment down below your excitement level. Be curious to know from a fan and from a book person if they're excited. As always, you're awesome and keep being awesome and see you next in the next video. Bye-bye.